Right, we got some girl power Woo! going on over here, Ken, at 747 Math Counts to the Coral Academy of Science. And we have the math chair of the Coral Academy, Autumn Norse is her name. She is here with Merva Adodu. Did I say it right? Yeah. I did? Okay. Uh, uh, Merva's a little quiet. She's seventh grade student and a competitor. And Victoria Green, she's a 10th grade student and a Mu Alpha Theta club member. Did I say that right? Okay, these girls are busy. They're here to talk about their upcoming girls math tournament. Welcome, guys, and congratulations. Y'all are like the brainiacs in school, huh? Yeah, kind of, sort of. You know what? Let me start with you, Autumn. Talk about uh, Coral Academy, what you guys focus on, and why this is such a big deal. Um, so we, we are charter school, and we um, focus on STEAM education. So this is a big deal because it's an all-girls math tournament mm -hmm. and it's promoting STEAM and giving girls confidence in, in math, which... Explain STEAM <coughs> for us, for STEAM? our viewers who so, might not have heard of it. Um, STEAM is science, technology, engineering, arts, and mathematics. Okay. And um, really, we feel that we're preparing our students for what their future is like yeah. and their jobs will be in STEAM fields. Yeah, so absolutely. preparing them. All right, <laughs> so when is the competition taking place? It's this Sunday from uh -huh. 1230 to 5 at the Sandy Ridge campus at Coral Academy of Science, Las Vegas. And is it open to the public or just Coral students? No, it's open to the public. Oh, yeah. great. Okay, uh, so mom and dad, for other girls who are into math, you want to do this, right? Okay, so uh, let me talk to you. Merva, I got to be honest with you, I hated math in school. None of my teachers ever made me love it so tell me why this is exciting for you and what your favorite uh, math your type of math is well I'd like to thank mr. Hickman for starting like with this competition and inspire inspiring so many people yeah. and I really like geometry right now you like geometry yeah. you're super smart I love that okay and what about you uh, Victoria what grade are you in and what's your favorite type of math um, I'm in 10th grade and I really like calculus miss um, Norris has helped me like math more so yeah so you had a teacher who really made you like it unlike mm -hmm. my teachers all the nuns who didn't make me like no <laughs> okay so um, what is the most challenging part of this competition for you do you think Cal calculus is pretty serious yeah um, I just say like the questions they're pretty difficult yeah um, like I don't know the average person probably can't solve them yeah so yeah. and I, I'm pretty average I can't solve any of them <laughs> but you guys okay so my producer told me you guys have a math problem for me we do it's so, this is gonna be so bad okay go ahead <laughs> all right so how many ways can you arrange the digits two zero one and eight so that it's a four-digit number what <laughs> <laughs> what say that again how many ways can you arrange the digits two zero one and eight uh -huh. so that it's always a four-digit number no, Victoria, <laughs> how many ways can you do it? Uh, it's 18. 18? Mm hmm So the answer was in the question. <laughs> See what I'm talking about? <laughs> okay, all right, guys, give us the information once again. Again, it's open to the public, so how can uh, other folks get their kids involved, their daughters? Go ahead, oh, you can tell me. Okay, yeah, you just go to um, caslv.org and there will be more information there. Or you can also just talk to your math teacher, too, because they should have some information about how to, how to get their girls signed up. Okay, wonderful. Ladies, uh, good luck to you. A pleasure meeting you.